Do you know what time is it? It's Tim time! And do you know what we're gonna do today? We are gonna make experiments with vinegar. But be very careful when you, if you try to repeat these experiments because it might be very dangerous. I hope you like experiments too. Let's start. So, what do we need for the first experiment? We need three eggs, water, two cups. So, first we put two eggs calmly into the cup. Then we add vinegar and water. Be very careful when you add the vinegar. Now let's add the water. Look, the eggs we put in the vinegar start bubbling. Now let's wait one day. Day one has passed. Let's look at the results. This is water and this is vinegar. The vinegar has a lot of bubbles in it. And the egg that was in the water does not have any bubbles and it's still raw. It did, the egg that was in the water did not change. It's hard and it's still the same size. The egg that was in the vinegar is really soft and it's raw but it's not hard. It's soft and squishy. It's really fun to play with. But be careful, it's still raw. Okay, now let's wrap the egg up with the tissue to dry it out. So soft and squishy. And bouncy. It's even bigger in size. I like to play with this so much. Okay, now let's put the raw egg that was in the water back into the water and let this egg stay. And we'll put this egg into maple syrup. Now we wait one more day. The second day has passed. Let's look at the results. Okay, the first egg that was in the water for two days, nothing happened to it. No bubbles, nothing. The second egg that was in vinegar for two days is almost clear. And it has a lot of bubbles. The third egg that was in maple syrup for one day definitely changed color and it got a little bit more squishy and now let's put this egg into water with dye okay and now let's add some color i choose blue dye because it looks very cool
Okay, look, the blue dye covered the entire egg. Look how fun it looks. Now let's mix it up. Done. And now let's wait one more day for the egg to be in water with dye. Day 3 has passed. Let's look at the results. The first egg that was in water for 3 days. The second egg that was in vinegar for 3 days. And the third egg that was in colorful water for 1 day. Let's take them out. Look how fun it is to play with them. They are so bouncy and colorful. But this one is not bouncy. It's very fragile. But these two are bouncy and squishy. But unfortunately, one of them uh, was on the top and it cracked a little, little bit. And it's harder than the other side. But that doesn't matter because it's still so fun to play with them. But be very careful, it's still the raw eggs. Okay, now let's go in the top. So the first egg that was in water for three days is the smallest. The second egg that was in maple syrup one day and in food coloring water for a one day is the second place. And the egg that was in vinegar for three days is first place. So the First, white egg, smallest, the second blue egg, a medium, and the vinegar egg, largest. Okay, now let's take a flashlight and flashlight at them. This one looks like a volcano. This one looks like a dinosaur egg that's green. And this one looks like a lava lamp with lava in it. this experiment so much and if you did too like this video for the next experiment we need baking soda food coloring a little bit of water with a jar vinegar and dish soap so we have three to four spoons of baking soda.
it is. Interesting fact. America has 160 active volcanoes, but three of them are increased activity. For the third experiment, we need baking soda, a glove, a jar, and vinegar. So what do you do first? You add the vinegar to the jar. Take a glove and carefully put it in the baking soda. And then when you're done, add it carefully to the jar so the baking soda didn't spill in it. And then add the soda to the jar. This is it for today. I hope you like my videos. And if so, like and subscribe for more videos. Till time is over. Bye!